Today I had a lunch meeting in this restaurant called Blue something or another. Anyhow, it's the third floor at Nordstrom. So it's not my fault that when I went into the store that I, I found a few things. Um, so let me show you. First we have, I got, I got my husband a bunch of shoes. They're similar, but I don't know which ones he's going to want to keep. These are um, 1901. I think that they're the Nordstrom store brand, and they're super squishy, and they don't have a big high heel. He doesn't like much of a heel. So these, I really hope he'll enjoy because I think they're beautiful. And I got him, see, I'm going to start with his stuff so that you all don't think I'm too selfish. And then a pair of Cole Haan. Aren't these great looking? Look at this. Look at this seam here. And I just, I love these. And again, super squishy because he does a lot of walking at work. And um, I'm sure he would much prefer to wear tennis shoes. But I don't know that they would appreciate that. And none of these, I have to say, these men's shoes, none of them broke the bank. Um, of course, I got a pair of Barbados, which I really like. They are different than the 1901s. They're like kind of a green khaki. See, they're very different in the black sole. But um, I just, I like this style. It's a little darker on the toe. I'm not sure. It's kind of a casual look. So I don't know if we'll go for that, but I think that these would be beautiful with jeans or with casual khaki. So let's see. We'll see though if I can get him to go for it. And then you can't go shopping without buying something, John Vervados, right? It's like, it seems to be ubiquitous. And, um, and then these again are a nice flat, squishy sole. So I don't know how he's going to do with this like kind of chuck height, but we're going to, we're going to give it a go and see, um, try everything on. And hopefully he'll keep most of these. Hopefully he'll keep all of them. All right. So that was him. And then, oh, okay. So then I was looking for a white shirt and which was funny. You should mention it. So I got together with my most favorite shopper ever. If you go to Santa Monica Place, you have to just go with Carly. She has the best taste in the world. Um, I got this little joie silk shirt, which is clearly I'm addicted to them. But you know what? It's much less expensive to buy one nice thing and have it last. And you can wear it more than once. And then this is, yeah, I got nothing from the sale. Just a nice white shirt a little longer in the back I have no idea what this brand is Bellatrix I have no idea but it's like a tunic and it's gonna require something under it but it's nice with a little cap sleeve there and this is um, called hinge oh totally was on sale by the way $65 with a little leather um, collar super sheer but I have like the perfect lilac camisole to wear under this. And I'm kind of, kind of excited because I feel like it's perfect with um, a black pencil skirt and a pair of black heels. Black heels, you say? Okay, so before Nordstrom's, I went over to Barney's because, let me show you the shoes I bought myself last week. I bought these for myself, these little Fendi ballet slippers. And they're just, look, they're such a nice neutral color that um, here in L.A. I can wear these all through the autumn. So, and they were marked down, marked down, marked down. They were under $200, um, which is still expensive, but they're going to last and I'm going to get good use out of them, right? So I'm wearing them and I see my mom and I was like, I love those shoes. I'm like, don't sweat it. I'll get you a pair. Or here, take mine. Well, she didn't want to take mine, so I went to go get her a pair they didn't have any more of the camel left. So I got, look how cute, these. It's, um, I'm not sure what color they call it, but it's just such a great color. So I don't know, but it's so off that it will be like a neutral color. I think you can wear this with just about anything. I think I could wear these with my yellow pants, just by the way. Um, so if she doesn't want these, 
I will keep them and give her the camel ones or whatever. It'll be fine. Thanks, Mom. Thanks for all that babysitting. And then, of course, oh, because Barney's was having a sale, right? So those were on sale. Well, it wouldn't be me unless I found what I wasn't looking for, which is, you guys, I have not bought this brand since forever because, I don't know, it hasn't, nothing's resonated with me, but I wanted to show you. Well, here, wait. Inside the shoe, do you see all that stitching? That's all padding. It's seriously like, you know how Cole Haan and Nike do it? It feels like that. But look at these heels. Are they like crazy sexy? And I think, um, I think that I'm gonna be able to get probably three or four years out of these. My, uh, my thing with black heels is that I buy one stupid expensive pair um, every few years and I really don't, I just don't replace them because I don't see the point in having an uncomfortable high heel or having like a low quality leather and replacing them, you know, every six months or whatever. So I just buy one beautiful pair and I hold on to them for as long as possible. Oh, I also got a pair of sunglasses, but I don't even know. I think they're downstairs. So um, that is my Nordstrom and Barney's haul and uh don't tell my husband 